listening, speaking. How can I help? Yes, I've just phoned this number and you put me through to an answering machine. Some what sort of some sort of continuous loop. Some some person was speaking about authority, having authority. Hello, hello. Yes. I did not connect you. All right. I connected someone who was requesting an appointment with Pastor Vito. Yes, okay. I did not, you did not speak with me. Okay. Can you tell me what your call is regarding, please? Yes, I'm, I've got a question regarding the Bible, something I don't understand. Can, can you hold on, please? Hold on, please. Yeah. Did you take a call concerning the Bible? Can you hold on, please? Yes, yes, thank you. I believe, I, I, believe it was, I believe the person call might be on the phone with someone right now. Can you hold on, please? Yes, thank you. Hello? Hello? I was trying to find out who took your call. One moment, please. Thank you. General Confessions. Those in authority. Except the Lord build a house, they labor in vain that build it. Except the Lord keep the city, the watchman wicked but in vain. Lord, we thank you for the people in authority at the local and national level. Hello, good afternoon. So I'm speaking. How can I help? Oh, hello there. Yes. Um, I'm curious about um, the church. I'm on the website at the moment. Could somebody yeah. help regarding tithing? Where is that binding upon Christians today? I thought tithing, tithing was for the, it was a form of taxation for the nation of Israel. I didn't think tithing was binding on Christians today. But your website seems to say that Christians should pay a tithe. Where is that in the Bible? Thank you. Where it is in the Bible? Well, one of the most popular places where the tithe is in the Bible is in Malachi, chapter three. Um, Malachi and, chapter. And, yep. Yeah. Can we can we go there and read it? Yeah, we can. Yeah. Malachi chapter three is about four hundred years before Christ. So there weren't yes, any Christians. This is given to the nation of, the, of Israel. I'm saying I'm saying that's one of the formidable places it's in the Bible. But we pay tithe because that's the reference to tithe paying paying was referenced in Hebrews. Okay? where's where's that? Perhaps you can in, read. In, in, in the book of Hebrews. Um Sorry, is is your name is is it robots? Yes, yes, we spoke Sam some 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 time ago. I'm still looking at this. Oh, uh, that's correct, Roberts. Roberts, you know what's, what what I would probably consider best in terms of time and usefulness. I have a book I'll send to you that we that we've done on tithing. I want you to read that book first, rather than this being. Um, I think it will be a more fruitful, um, you know discussion if i send you that book first and then you and i can then have a chat we can set the okay. time to okay to i'll give you chat. i'll give you my address okay right yes okay yes. so robert it's already five o'clock so mail is gone for today the earliest you will receive the book um will be today is wednesday will be Friday. So if I send it out tomorrow, okay, thank you, you should be able to get it on Friday. If not, then Saturday thereabouts. I will. So I will read it. I'll thank you. Put that, yeah, I'll put that in the post. I would definitely encourage you to read that, and then you and I can then have a conversation. Could you please uh, write something in the inside cover? Because if I'm given a book as a gift, I like to have a memento, something written from the person who gave it. Okay, that's fine. That's that's fine. Um, Hebrews chapter seven, of course, is is talking about the doing away of the law, the the annulling of the law. Hebrews seven eighteen, and it uses the example of tithing to Levi to express the fact that the law has been annulled. 
So it's not advocating tithing, it's doing away with tithing. It's contrasting. Yeah, I think the, the principle there is the fact that he was making reference to Jesus and making reference to the fact that, you know, that there was tied in, you know, in that Abraham paid tithe for his fourth generation. So they paid, I mean, he was making reference to the fact that they paid tithe in Abraham. So when Abraham was paying tithe, he, they, they were, he was actually paying tithe, you know, for his children's children, as it were. It, it doesn't say fourth, was, fourth generation. I think you've, you've read that into the text. I'm looking at the text now. It, it simply contrasts... No, I'm not talking about that text. You, you've got to read, you just don't read one text. You know, the Bible, when you're studying the Bible, Robert, you have to, one of the key words, just like you have that word, Location, location, location. In in studying the Bible, context rules. You just don't read one verse and take the verse out of context. There's a context. So I think, as I said, let's not debate All right. that. All right, now. thank you. I'll yeah. read it. I'll, think, I'll read the book. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think read the whole, read the, read the, read the book, and then on the back of the book, let's have a chat. All right, thank you very much. Bye. That's a care of it. Take care. Bye, Sam.